Hey y'all, I'm here today with a, another plan with me from January 2nd to the 8th. And I am using the Oh Dearest collection from the Paperly Boutique, which I got this last year because I am filming this on the 1st of January, so Happy New Year to everyone. But I have been, I had been holding on to this kit to use specifically in January. So I just have the date cover-ups, which I already put the date dots on to make it quicker when I put, when I go to put them down. And then I have the glitter headers, the main two-page kit. So, just, so you just have all the flags, icons, single heart checklist, weekend banner, deco, functional icons, a couple of half boxes, dots, and a quote box that says, I'm quite fond of you, my dear. And then the other page, you have the washi strips, or like the bottom washi, and then the solid color washi, the weekly ombre, some headers, and more half boxes. And then I also have the full boxes and little things. So what I am going to do first is put down the bottom washi down at the bottom. So what I think I am going to do is I do have this washi from Recollections that I am actually going to put over top of this washi right here. I'm trying to look to see how much space I need to leave. So I think if I just put it down right at the second line, I should be okay. And then let me do the other side, and then I'll put this one down. Okay, now that I have those two down, I am just going to take, if I can get the end... And this isn't an exact color match, but it is close enough. And just take this and put it down right above that. And then I am actually going to take my little baby scissors and just cut off. The end of it. And that one's a little crooked right there, but that isn't going to bother me too, too much. And then I'm going to do the other side really quickly. And this is actually going pretty fast compared to the last couple of times I have put washi down where I've had to end up cutting it out of the video because it ends up taking like four to five minutes just to cut the washi and put it down. So again I am just going to trim off the ends and over here as well. So that is it for my washi going down and again just like I mentioned over here that little crookedness isn't going to bother me at all. So now I am going to take the date cover-ups and just put them up at the top over the correct date obviously.
and if I can I like to leave a little bit of white space between the header and the date cover up. Especially since I am leaving a bit of white space down here and I also don't have the ombre checklist that went with this kit. So since there is going to be a bit more white space for this week, I am. Um, I wanted to leave the white space up with the date cover-ups and down here with the washi. So now that I have all of those down, first before I do the glitter headers, I am going to take two of the flags and just put them over on the corner so I think I am going to take this flag and put it over here and these don't exactly match it there's a teeny teeny tiny bit that doesn't get covered up and I have to peel this date cover up to put that flag down but it is nothing too terribly concerning. As long as it covers up most of the flag, I am not too worried. Okay, so I have both of those down and now I am going to go in with the glitter headers and I think what I'm going to do is I don't think I'm going to put the dark blue up at the top because the date cover-ups are the dark blue. So I think I am going to do this pink color. Just to bring in a bit more pink up at the top. And then I'll probably do the other pink down at the bottom. Just to bring in more pink down there. Okay, come on, header. And of course I get it straight and it goes off center. Okay, come on header, be nice to me. Okay, there we go. That is a bit better. Now let's see if I can get the other headers down. I need to fix Saturdays really quickly. Okay, now that I have all of those down, I'm going to go ahead and go in and put my checklist down and like I've done with some of the past couple spreads that I have done, I am going to match the color of the 
checklist up with the color of the date dot. Which I like doing it that way because I don't have to think too much about what order to put them in. I can just follow the kind of color blocking, but not really color blocking. And for the last three days, oh geez, Friday is not being good to me. And the last checklist. Okay, so that is it for the checklist. Now I am going to go in and put, I'm going to do the dark blue glitter headers right here. And that way it's kind of like a blue, pink, blue, pink, blue, pink kind of alternating somewhat in the colors of the kit, but not actually alternating the colors if that makes any sense at all. Like the date covers are blue and then the glitter header under that is pink and then the next glitter header, the ones that I'm putting down now are blue and then the glitter headers that will go right here will be pink and then the bottom washi is, washi is blue. And now that I have this down, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go in and do my sidebar really quickly. So I'm going to take the quote box that says, I'm quite fond of you, my dear, and fond and dear are spelled like D-E-E-R, like the animal deer, and fond is F-A-W-N apostrophe D like the um like female deer so what i am going to do is switch y'all on your side and i am lining y'all up because i don't want to cover up that little loop on the j in january i am going to line y'all up as best as I can because I can never get anything straight on my sidebar with the second dot because if you have the neutral planner you know that there is that little dotted box so instead of the first row of dots I am doing it with the second row of dots and then next I have this little Paperly Boutique sampler that I am going to take the habit tracker off of and it isn't an exact match but it was the best color option that I could get. And then while I remember it I am going to take the little kettlebell off of the functional page and put this If 
I can get it straight right there and it is covering up a bit of the quote but that is completely okay and then what I am going to do is I have I have the ombre checklist here for the weekly ombre and then I have the checklist left over from the Wonderland kit because I figured these two blues I could use but I think I am going to use the darker blue first and then if I need to go and use the lighter blue I can but I'm going to put this off to the side really quickly and I am going to take off the weekly ombre and the workout header and I am going to put the workout header if I can get it straight underneath the habit tracker because my habit tracker is tracking if I work out that day and then I'm going to put the weekly ombre under the workout header and then I am going to take a this week header this down and then take one of the dark blue checklist from the once again the Wonderland collection and put this right underneath the header okay so I have that down and then I'm either going to fill in this space with washi but I want to make sure I don't need any other spaces filled in first before I put any down there so I'm going to move y'all back up to where y'all were okay so now I am going to take the full boxes and I think I am going to semi color block the full boxes to the um, colors of the checklist and I think the two dark ones will go with the darker checklist and then I only have one with the pink background on it I think I'm going to use all of them except for this one and this one I'll either turn into washi or I'll figure out something to do with that but I am going to take the first dark colored checklist not checklist dark blue full box and put that down and then while I'm at it I'm going to take the other one and put it down over under the other dark blue checklist and that that is looking crooked better and then the weekend banner it doesn't really matter what I put down because it has all the colors in it so I'm thinking deer I don't want to put the deer head on the weekend So I think I want to do this flower I want to do on Sunday and then This one I am going to do on Wednesday. And 
And then all the checklists that are left are all pink. So I think I am going to take the the deer I am going to put on, if I can peel it up without tearing it. There we go. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm going to take the deer and put it on Thursday, so it's kind of in the middle of the week. And then I am going to take this pink one and put it on Wow, that was crooked. No. Oops, tearing up my page. I'm going to put that one on Tuesday and then this one on a Saturday. And I ended up tearing the back of the sticker, the sticker off, which I don't know how that happened. But I'm going to put this one on Saturday. And like I mentioned, I am going to save that for either washi or do something else with it. So next I am going to take the pink glitter headers and just put them right underneath the full boxes. And I am putting them right here as opposed to putting my little things down first and then filling up the um, glitter headers over top of them is so I can cover up the gray header which even if they were peeking through, they wouldn't be too bad, but I still wanted to cover them up. Okay, so now I have all of the glitter headers done. I am now going to go in with the little things. So first off, I am going to take the meal little things and put those down first. And I'm going to need to fix Monday's little thing. There we go, and then for the other half of the week. And then once I get done putting these down, then it will be into the actual like plan plans for the week, which I don't have any plans at all. Which I don't know if that is a good thing or a bad thing. A good thing because with the holidays just happening, we've it's been like go, go, go around here. But bad because then I don't have anything to really mark in my planner so I have all of those down and then I am going to look up my TV shows okay so I have 
I don't have four TV shows, but I have TV shows on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday and Sunday and what I am doing is instead of putting like three different TV shows on Tuesday or Wednesday or whichever day I have my shows on I'm just putting one TV label down and then writing like the channel down because most of my shows that I watch they're all going to be on the same channel so instead of putting like two or three or more TV labels down for each show I will just put like Tuesday would be I'd have the TV label down then I might write in like ABC Tuesday so I know all of my shows are on ABC on Tuesday so that is why I'm only putting four labels down and putting like like I said, like three or four each a day for all the different shows that I have. But now that I have the TV shows down, I am going to take the two laptop stickers and I am going to put one on Monday and one on Tuesday for my Playing with me's that go up on both of those day on both of those days, and then what I'm going to also do is take a um, take the little little thing that has the paper and pen on it, and put those right above the computer little thing and I'm going to use that to mark posting the videos or the links to the videos to like my, my social media accounts like Instagram, Twitter, stuff like that and then what I am going to do now while I'm thinking about it is take the little cleaning bottle And I'm actually going to take this dark blue checklist and I need two hearts off of it so I am going to cut off the probably very crookedly the Top two hearts, and yes, that was very crooked. Which actually, I am going to peel up the TV header really quickly. I'm going to put the cleaning icon cleaning icon the cleaning little thing up at the top and then I am going to put the checklist right underneath that because the top is straight because I didn't cut that part and then I am going to put the TV little thing back down and that way that kind of covers up the crookedness And then also while, while I am thinking about it, I am going to grab the little grocery cart little thing and do the same thing as well. Only this time I think I am just going to 
No, I still want to cut that one off. I'm going to cut that off and then just hold on to that last little heart and it This one, I will layer the shopping buggy over top of that. So now I have my little to clean checklist and my little shopping checklist as well. And then I'm making sure, I know there are other things I have to put down, but I'm making sure I'm not forgetting anything for those couple of days. So I have, while I'm thinking of it, I'm going to take the little, actually I'm not going to do a little thing, I'm going to take this pink patterned half box and put it right there and then I'm going to take the pink camera and the planner and I'm actually going to put them in opposite corners instead of stacking them on top of each other to mark filming the next week's plan with me and then Now I'm just looking at what all we have planned for this week. So I think I'm going to move these off to the side and just kind of go in, whoop, just kind of go in day by day. So Monday we are taking all of our Christmas decorations down so I think I am going to use this patterned half box and I'm just going to line it up against the little thing and it is overlapping the glitter header a little bit but that is okay. And then is there an icon? I could put the packing, or not packing, but package. Because we are putting the, um, like we're putting the decorations and stuff back into boxes. So I will use that for that. And then I am going to grab my little scales if I can find them. Okay, here they are. And these are from the Paperly Boutique. And I am going to grab, what color do I want? I kinda wanna use this use this dark blue and I'm just going to put it I'm going to put it right there it covers up the flower but that is okay and it doesn't match perfectly but that is also okay as well and then that is it for Monday for Tuesday I'm just going to take this pink half box and put it in the middle. And that is for getting our eyebrows done that day. I don't see any um, 
icon or anything that would really work. So I'm just going to leave it as it is. And Wednesday, I have cleaning down and then I am going to take a little thing and I'm going to grab the little box label and put this right up towards the top and that will be for ordering more medicine for my dog. And then Thursday, I just have the video, but I also want to take the little garbage icon and put that up at the top. I'm actually going to put it over here to mark garbage and recycle day. And then that is it for Thursday for Friday. I already have the shopping marked down and then that is also I'm going to take this half box and put it, do I want to put it sideways? No, I actually think I'm going to do it like this and just put it is off centered. And this will be to mark that my dog is getting her medicine on that day. And again, I don't really have any icons for that. If I had paw print icons, I would use those, but there aren't any paw print icons in this kit, so I can't do that. And then nothing for Saturday and nothing else for Sunday. So now what I think I am going to do is I'm going to take this little piece of washi right here and just put it down at the bottom right there just to cover up the last couple of lines. And instead of filling this in with washi, I think I am just going to um, use the half box and put this down, but can I peel up the little thing without it tearing? Yes, I can. So instead of just cutting, did I call this a half box? A full box. Instead of cutting it, I am going to and it went down crookedly. So I'm going to put that down and then that down right there and then I think I am going to take yeah that won't be big enough That still isn't quite big enough, but I want to cover that space up. Let me see if I just do these two, if it will work.
and I'll just overlay this one a bit. And then that way I have that, that little white space for Thursday covered up and I'm not too concerned with the white space behind Tuesday and Sunday and those half boxes. And I'm looking and I don't think there's anything else that I need to put down. Plain wise, I'm going to put the weekend banner down now. But as far as plans go, so I'm just going to put this right here. As straight as I can and as best as in the middle that I can get. So I think that is everything that I need to put down for this week. I'm just looking over to make sure there aren't any icons I can put for the eyebrows and for my dog getting her medicine. And again, I don't say anything that I could use. So I think that is it for this week's plan with me. If you liked it, you can hit the thumbs up button down below. If you want to see more videos like this and you haven't already subscribed, you can hit the subscribe button down below as well. And I will see y'all next time. Bye.